Greetings and welcome to another DIY with Plus 4 Charisma Christmas edition. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to make a stocking of devouring. So essentially, this is a play on a bag of devouring, except with a stocking, which is a bag of sorts. A bag of devouring resembles a bag of holding, except for the fact that it's actually a creature's orifice from another dimension. And as soon as you put any form of organic matter in the bag, the bag eats it. And there's also a 50% chance that if a person reaches into the bag that the creature eats them. The stuff that we're gonna need is a stocking, some scissors, poster board. I have some red fabric for the inside and the tongue and such, and googly eyes. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to line the inside with red. And I'm actually going to take the top part of this and loop it over the outer of it a little bit of this. I wanted to show that this is a bag of devouring from the outside as well. Okay, so right now we have this. The way I do teeth is I cut strips and then I I'm going to double this over to do it to make it go thicker. And then cut triangles. Down, so, these, and then we'll cut these each in smaller pieces because if they're all in one long piece, as I learned with the abelette, that won't work for the malleability of it. There we go, have them about that big. And then I'm just going to bend them, bend it and then take a strip of glue. And then glue it like so. And then we're going to do the rest. So then we're just gonna put the tongue in and then we're actually just gonna be done with them. Okay, I found a, a, a pink shirt and I never really wear it. So, you know, if it's in the interest of a DIY, I'll always cut it up. Who needs this anyway? Start here. Sure, yeah. So I'm just gonna take this paper and kind of an indent. On the indent, I'm going to take this and just Make a line of glue, turn it over in the middle, and per plop. And then press it down. And then I'm going to take the edges and then just come around the edges. So we'll use glue to your heart's content and with abandon. Just put a big old wide glue on there. Make sure you have it back where you want it. Probably where people can't see your messy glue job. Bunch this up a little bit because we want this to stand up too so that people can see the eyes. And now we just need our googly eyes. So I think that this turned out pretty cute for an extra dimensional monster. And as you can see, I am really in the Christmas spirit, whatever that means. I am the spirited of the spirited. I am most spirited. I should win an award for being so Christmassy. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy this video, please subscribe to the channel. Drop a comment, hit that like button. And as with the last video, if you have any suggestions for a name for this beautiful, sweet creature that only wants to eat a little bit of you or actually all of you, please drop a comment and give a suggestion. Uh, have a good Christmas and New Year and Valentine's Day.